He is known for being a German writer who received the Nobel Prize in Literature. He was born in the free city of Danzig and served as a soldier in the Waffen-SS during World War II. Recognized as a key figure in European magic realism, he is best known for his novel The Tin Drum. His name is Gunter Wilhelm Grass. In the world of literature, one name stands out as an influential figure, Gunter Wilhelm Grass, a multifaceted artist whose impact on the literary world is undeniable. Born in the free city of Danzig, Grass's upbringing shaped his storytelling. As a teenager, he experienced the chaos of war, serving as a soldier before being captured and held as a prisoner of war by U.S. forces. These experiences would leave an indelible mark on his work. Trained as a stonemason and sculptor, Grass's artistic journey took a different turn when he began writing in the 1950s. His masterpiece, The Tin Drum, propelled him to literary fame. This groundbreaking novel, part of the Danzig trilogy along with Cat and Mouse and Dog Years, introduced readers to European magic realism. It became a key text in the genre, exploring themes of history, identity, and the forgotten aspects of our past. Grass's works were not only renowned for their literary merits but also carried a strong political dimension. As an active supporter of the Social Democratic Party of Germany, he used his writing to shed light on social issues and advocate for progressive ideals. His ability to weave together frolics and black fables and historical elements earned him widespread recognition. In fact, his contributions to literature were so profound that he was awarded the Nobel Prize in Literature in 1999, solidifying his status as a legendary figure in the literary world. In the late 1950s, a writer named Gunter Grass burst onto the literary scene with his groundbreaking work, The Tin Drum. Published in 1959, this novel would become his most famous and enduring achievement. It was the first book in what would later be known as the Danzig Trilogy, a series of works that explored the rise of Nazism and the impact of World War II on the city of Danzig. Following the success of The Tin Drum, Grass continued his exploration of Danzig's history with two more books. In 1961, he released Cat and Mouse, a powerful novella that delved deeper into the themes of war and political turmoil. Then, in 1963, he concluded the trilogy with the novel Dog Years, which acted as a sequel to The Tin Drum, featuring some of the same characters and reflecting the complex ethnicities and historical background of the area. Grass's ability to depict the haunting realities of Danzig's past through lyrical prose set him apart as one of Germany's leading authors. The Tin Drum, in particular, became a benchmark against which all his subsequent works were measured. Critics, however, sometimes found his later works lacking in comparison, always returning to the brilliance of his seminal piece. But Grass's success was not without controversy. In the conservative climate of post-war West Germany, the Tin Drum's portrayal of immorality and taboo subjects caused a stir. In fact, the city of Bremen even revoked a prize it had previously awarded him. Despite this backlash, the novel's impact on German literature was profound, leading the Nobel Committee to declare that its publication was a new beginning for a language and culture that had suffered decades of destruction. The Danzig Trilogy stands as Gunter Grass's greatest literary achievement. Through the pages of The Tin Drum, Cat and Mouse, and Dog Years, he transported readers to the heart of World War II, shining a light on the complexities of history and the enduring power of storytelling. Do you want to explore more novelists? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.